Hey guys, welcome to Kalita Vlogs, and today I am rectifying a very horrible mistake I made in which my mic was turned off for a uh, Taming Azeroth, the Eastern Kingdoms portion. So, we're gonna try this again. Uh, I'm really hoping this works this time. I didn't notice until today someone brought it to my attention, so thank you, kind person, you know who you are. Uh, so, let's get started. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to... We're gonna do Eastern Kingdoms, which is Alliance only. Um, or you'll get Kalimdor next Monday. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna tell you what what types of pets each person has in the order that you'll be fighting them, and uh, how many pets, and what level all the pets are. So Eastern Kingdoms, again, this is only for Alliance, and let's start. So the first one is in Elwyn Forest, is Julia Stevens. She has two pets, both beasts, and both are level two. The next one is in Westfall, Old MacDonald. He has three pets, uh, Flying, Mechanical, and Critter. They are all level three. Actually, I should make, they're all the same level. So I'll just uh, start saying it like that. And then is Lindsay in Red Ridge. She has three critters, level five. Eric Davidson in Duskwood has three beasts, level seven. Uh, Steven Lisbane in Northern Stranglethorn, right here, has two beasts and a magic at level nine. Bill Buckler in the Cape of Stranglethorn has two flying and a humanoid at level 11. Uh, David Kose has a beast, a magic, and a critter at level 13 in the Hinterlands. Diza Plaghorn, Diza Plaghorn maybe, I don't know, has two beasts and an undead at level 14 in Eastern Plaguelands. Uh, Kortos Darkhammer in Steering Gorge has two, no, all three Dragonkins, sorry, and they are level 15. Durin Darkhammer in Burn, Burning Step has a flying, a critter, and an elemental at level 17. Everessa has, in Swamp of Sorrows, has a beast, an aquatic, and a flying at level 16. And finally, Lydia Acost has two undeads and an elemental at level 19 in Deadwind Pass. Um, so that's it for this one. Again, if you can I guess I say, I say again because I've done this before, but if you can get your pets to level, let's say, 20, 21, it doesn't matter if they're if you're fighting something that's strong against you or weak or whatnot. Um, a couple levels ahead is more than enough to get these ones. I didn't find that I needed to have particular um, types of pet for fighting until I hit the last trainer in Northrend. Um, so for this, just pick your favorite team and kind of go at it. Hope you found that helpful, guys. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.